guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel so I was recently looking through my little family photo album and I was looking at some of my parents pictures from back in the 90s and I just thought of the idea you know why not recreate some of their outfits because I was looking at some of these pictures and I was like well my parents were pretty swagging back in the day so I was like you know what I'm gonna try to recreate some of their looks so I pulled up a couple pictures from my dad and my mom I was like First I was just going to do my mom and then I saw some pictures of my dad and I was like, you know what, why not do my dad as well? So I just picked some of my favorite outfits that they had on and put some outfits together. So let's just get started and let me show you guys how to put these outfits together. Alright, so the first outfit I am going to be recreating is this one from this picture of my dad. And okay, so for the outfit detail, so I'm gonna, for the hair, I am just gonna do a slick back bun, cause obviously I don't have short hair like my dad, so I'm just gonna do a bun. And then for this top, he is wearing like a blue dressy top. I am going to wear this like light blue silky top, button, button up top that I got from Sheen. That's pretty close to the one he's wearing. And then right here, he is also wearing a black belt. So I'm gonna be wearing this plain black belt. And then of course, and then with the belt, of course, the white pants he's wearing in those pictures. So I'm just gonna wear it with this plain white pants from Sheen. And then for the shoes, you it looks like he's wearing some like all white like loafer style shoes. I'm going to pair the outfit with these white loafers that I have that I got from Sheen. So let's put this outfit together and see how it looks. Alright, so for outfit number two that I'm going to be recreating for my dad. So again, with the hair, I'm just going to be wearing a slick back bun. And then right here, he has like this um, light blue button-up shirt. I decided to pair it with this light jean jacket I have. So just pair it with this plain, like this light jean jacket. I don't remember exactly where I got it from, but I'm going to wear this. And then underneath that jean um, top he has like a white turtleneck so I am going to pair it with this just simple white turtleneck from forever 21 and then for the jeans it looks like he's wearing like some dark jeans I'm just gonna wear my dark wash mom jeans from Hollister and then for sh the shoes you can't really tell what type of shoes he's wearing but based on like pictures I saw from my dad back in the days he liked to wear a lot of like loafers and like little booties so I decided I'm gonna pair it with these white little boots I have here okay and I don't know if you could tell in the picture but in that picture he's also wearing like this gold um, chain which is why I'm gonna pair it with this um, gold chain that has like the Virgen de Guadalupe so I'm just gonna add that to the fit you know just so it could look spot on all right so now that we have the pieces together let's see how it looks on so now let's move on to my mom so the first outfit I am going to be recreating for my mom it is this outfit right here I'm trying to cover the person that's next to her but I'm gonna be trying to recreate this outfit right here so for her hair she looks like she just have it like half up half down which is what I'm gonna be doing with my hair and then for her earrings she has like some um, little white ball earrings with so yeah, it looks like she has like some white little ball earrings. So I'm gonna wear these that I got from Sheen. I don't know if you can tell. I'm gonna wear these that I got from Sheen. And then she's wearing like a white like blazer. 
which is why I'm gonna I'm gonna put on this like white blazer dress that I got from I ordered it from Amazon and then for the skirt it looks like she just has like this black with white polka dot skirt which is why I'm gonna for the skirt I'm gonna be wearing this skirt that's kind of similar to hers and this one is from Sheen and then it looks like she just has some like plain black tights which I have except might have little hearts in it but you know you gotta put a little sprinkle to the outfit and then for the shoes it looks like she has like some white pointy little pumps but you know I have to work with what I have so, so I'm just gonna be wearing these black pumps that I got from Sheen and it just has a little bedazzle in the toe area that looks like her shoes have as well so yeah now I have my pieces together so let's see how it looks put together So for the second look I'm gonna be recreating for my mom, it's probably like my favorite one out of all these outfits I'm recreating because I feel like this outfit screams very like 90s and just that era back then. So I got some little pieces together. So she just has her hair down, which I'm just gonna have my hair down for this. And then she has like just this black plain headband and I'm just gonna use this white, this black headband I got for a present. And then with it, she has the black long sleeve. And I just have this simple black long sleeve from Old Navy. And then with it, of course, the one of my favorite pieces from this outfit is a little fringe jacket. Which is this one. Right here. And honestly, I just stole this from my mom's closet. So I really don't know where she got this from. But I've seen some in Amazon, you just look up print, black, brown fringe um, vest. So I just got this one to wear with it. And then, of course, and alright, and then again the little chain. Okay, so for the pants she just has like some plain white mom style jeans it looks like. So I'm just going to wear the same ones from Sheen I wore in the other outfits. And then for the shoes, you can't really see what shoes she's wearing. But based on the pictures I've seen from my mom, she wore a lot of like pumps and like booties. So I decided just to pair it with these um, black simple booties. And I think it will look great with this outfit. And these are from Mark Fisher. So just added these on for the outfit. So now let's see how it looks. So now moving on to the third outfit I'm going to be recreating for my mom and well also the last outfit I'm going to be recreating for this video it is this outfit right here. So right next to her are those little rascals next to her that I call my siblings. But for the outfit she just has again like a half up, half up, um, half up, half down up to uh, I'm going to try to recreate so that's what I'm going to do with my hair. For the top she just has like this plain white button up shirt so for the top I'm just gonna wear like this simple white button up top I have and this one I believe is from Forever 21 and then for she has like this white belt on it so I'm just wearing this white simple belt with it from Forever 21 and then for the like shorts or like some mom shorts I guess you could call them and hers are light wash but I decided to you know just work with what I have so I'm just gonna go with this darker wash jeans I feel like they're kind of similar to hers by because they're kind of high-waisted and they're long the only difference is mine are darker than, than hers and I just thrifted these from Goodwill and then for the shoes she's wearing like some white pump boots 
But I just decided to pair it with these simple like slip-on transparent um, little sandals I had. So just to go with the outfits, I just decided to pair it with this. Alright, so now that we have all the pieces we need to recreate this outfit, let's just see how it looks together. Alright, so that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing me recreate these outfits that my parents were, wore back in the 90s and trying to recreate some of these pictures. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, definitely give this video a thumbs up. And also, if you do have any video suggestions, definitely leave them in the comments down below. And I'll try to do that video for you guys. And also, like always, if you guys are new on this side of the internet, or if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe down below to my channel. It would mean a lot to me if you guys do. And we'll like always, see you guys next time. Thank you.